Once you've perfected your GarageBand project, send it to iTunes, where you can add it to your playlists, transfer it to your iPod, or listen to it in your living room using Apple TV. Simply select Share, Send Song to iTunes. Enter the iTunes playlist you want your song to appear in. If the playlist doesn't already exist, iTunes will automatically create it. Add the artist, composer, and album names so that your song will be easy to find in your music library. This information can also be stored as a preference so that you don't have to re-enter it for each new song. This can be done by choosing GarageBand, Preferences, and then clicking on the My Info tab. Compression settings make it so your song will use less space when stored. The default AAC type is the same type of compression used by the iTunes Music Store. You can also choose MP3 or store your song in full CD quality by deselecting the compressed checkbox. Click Share and your song will quickly be mixed down into a single stereo audio file. After a few moments, iTunes will automatically open and play your song.